Atticus Atlas, you remember just before uh, December uh, the caterpillars went into the, the cocoons and now we kept them inside in a warm place and sprayed uh, the cocoons all the time because it's a tropical species that comes from hot and very wet the tropical forest so you have to keep the pupas uh, very wet and now the first of this very beautiful caterpillars changed into an even more beautiful and even bigger adult moss look here it's a, it is a wonderful uh, animal I, tr I try to take it out carefully it's a female here and of course we can take it on the hand then too, but look. Look how big it is. It's called the snake head moss also because the end of the wings look like the head of a snake here with the eye and the mouth part. And the wings, they are transparent so you can look through here, through these parts. Uh, of the wings and also the body is very interesting with these uh, dots around the spiracles. The head with this orange antennas. I mean this is really one of the most beautiful animals of this world and the biggest moth if you count the if you count the, the wing itself, not the spread wings, but the flat of the wings. So that's beautiful. I can't even put it under the lens because it's too big for that. But it's also a nice picture to see this beautiful, beautiful colors of this moss. In some places they collect, of course, the the cocoons, the empty ones, and but also of course the the ones that have still the pupa inside to collect the Fogara silk. It's one of the different silks that are produced in this world. But um, yeah, there's no silk with the color like this. You know, it would be nice if we could have the colors of these beautiful wings of Atacus uh, Atlas. Now what I have to do, I have to wait until a male comes out because also here look I have some more cocoons here still waiting for explode explosion but this is a it's a hard process because if the female now who has no mouse parts to eat or drink is dying in the next two or three days without uh, having a, um, a male around to fertilize the egg so it will be too late uh, for them and then I have to see for um, another collector or cultivator who can um, give me a male or a female whenever the next uh, come out here. But of course I try to spray it now very heavily so that they can come out and let's see whether we are lucky and can't find a beautiful male for this nice female of Otakus uh, Atlas. Thanks for watching. If you want to stay up to date just subscribe the channel. I send you an email whenever a new video is ready here. Thanks for watching.